Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jarrell here holding it down for Jarrell Fitness. And y'all already know, man. Check your watch because it's time to grow, bro. What's going on, man? Shout out to the T2G Nation. But anyway, man, I don't want to keep y'all too long. But speaking of fast service, man, damn. I just made my video talking about how I was going to get my weightlifting belt in like a few weeks. That's what I was thinking. Came home from work, looked on the floor right by the front door, and I saw a package laying. I'm like, what could this be? It can't be my fucking belt. But yes, indeed, it was my belt. So anyway, guys, check it out, man. I covered up my address, man. I don't want nobody showing up to my house like, what's up, man? You know, <laughs> no, I ain't that type of party. But anyway, man. <laughs> so anyway, man, this is the package right here. As you guys can see, man, straight from the boys over at Enzer. Um, I actually put the order in for this like on a Saturday. And today is Wednesday. So it took like a few business days, what, three business days for me to get this. So it was pretty fast. So probably mainly to do with the fact that I probably got a black one. They always said on the website that if you get a black one, it'll come a little quicker. So I'm going to go ahead and do an unboxing video of this belt right here. And I'm going to show you guys, all right? All right, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and just slice this bitch open with my box cutter. Serial killer. Eh, eh, just kidding. Anyway, man. <laughs> Let me go ahead and slice this open so we can see this belt, man. So here we go, man. Wow. Check that out. Ooh, this bitch. Yeah, it's heavy, man. Got some weight on it. Okay. Okay, so this is the belt right here. Mmm, got that. Fresh leather smell to it, you know. And, um, I guess it's the hardware that comes along with it. The actual le lever. So as you guys can see, this is how it looks in the package. I guess these are the directions on how to put the um the lever on there and shit like that. So anyway, all right, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Put this bitch together, and then we gonna see how it fit. All right, y'all. Okay, y'all. I'm all finished putting it together, so it's pretty easy. And ain't nothing but this piece, this little metal piece right here, and two screws. So it didn't take me that long. It probably only took me like five minutes. But the hardest thing is to figure out, you know, how tight you want the belt to be, because it got a few holes right here. You gotta place it wherever you want to place it. So the further back you put it, the more tighter the belt will be. I went with a large, I'm kind of wishing that I might have went with like a medium. I'm actually at 36 waist, but it's still cool. I still got like three more spaces right here to make it a little tighter, but it's all good for right now. We're going to just see how it work out. But, um, you know, that's the other side right there. So let me go ahead and put this on so I can show you guys how it fits. Right. Okay, y'all, if y'all can see, I got it on. Now it's loose right now. So I'm going to go ahead and pull the lever. Ah. Ooh, man, that is snug, man. This shit feel good right here. Check that up. Man, this is definitely an upgrade for your boy, man. So I can feel the power right now, man. Just putting it on right now. So fits pretty well. You know, it's tight. Boom, loose. Okay, then boom. So this is cool, man. I like this. This is pretty swagged up you feel me so that's what's up man so i'm be doing squats doing deadlifts all type of shit okay so that's what's up so let me go ahead and take it off real quick because it's a bitch taking this thing off especially when you first get it that's what everybody told me so i actually had to do some i'm gonna show y'all what i had to do to kind of make it easier to take off i actually had to take my screwdriver that i put the bitch together with and stick it up in here and just pry it out. Okay. I know this looks crazy, but that's what I had to do. <laughs> so, my boy Brandon Campbell over there, he warned everybody about this in his video. I actually watched his video on how to put it together. So anyway, guys, um, one of the things that will become troublesome for you to take it off is you see these prongs are smooth right here, but these have like this little hook part. And what happens is when you put those prongs into this set of holes right here, 
what happens is it'll get hooked up in there and caught. So what I did was to kind of make those holes a little wider, I just took a screwdriver and I kind of just went up in here and I kind of just scraped, scraped and scraped a little bit. It's a little dirty right here just from some of the stuff that came out, but you see, nice and clean. A little scuffed up, I'll just wipe that with a rag or whatever like that, but it's all good. So this is a quick little tip. You might want to try to widen these holes, these holes right here out like a little bit, just kind of Stick it in there and just kind of scrape around, make it more loose so you can pop the belt right off. So that's pretty much it, man. I'm looking forward to using this in some future videos. So anyway, if you guys like this video, go ahead and like it. Comment and subscribe to your boy Jarrell here, Jarrell Fitness. And like I said at the beginning, y'all already know, it's time to grow, bro. I'm going to holler at y'all later. Deuces. It's a baby. Yeah. All right. That's the thing that's going on in America right now is like a lot of people are not into the fitness lifestyle. A lot of people are not into bodybuilding, um, powerlifting, CrossFit. 